can put on on except Nature's Prophet. Maybe that's the next one he'll play carry. Who, do, who sure. knows? Uh, but yeah, he's getting the heart. This kill is ridiculously difficult oh, to jump perform. jump in, toss back. They found themselves a target. There's Bristol back with a fresh Assault Cuirass. That's a lot of life and armor they have to get through. Yuaz giving it a shot. OG have come in deep. CC and C once again just stunned up a control from the back line, trying to create more space. It'll be the first one to die here. The roar is finally out, but for what a veil. Nothing is really going here. And Thompson, he's the man that's going, going, going into the fountain once again. Kunkaboat. The Kunkaboat is also pretty significant if you can get it off, but... Oh yeah, Kunkaboat is huge, but I don't think anything compares to the RP. Yeah. Bottom lane. No tail trying to set up onto Somnus. The remnant for Wadana. The boat's already out though for Somnus. Somnus trying to look at the trees. He's hunting actually down No Tail. The global silence comes out. And not quite able to get on top of X Nova. As X Nova keeps his distance. Somnus just turning and beating down on No Tail. No Tail will go down as well as uh, X Nova. One for one at the moment. The sentry's down here from OG. They have eyes on Somnus. Seb still holding him for the side. Then there'll be a buyback from No Tail. The boat, the stolen boat, the RP coming through. They're jumping in the web boys there with a the slam. Ready to hold off for the fight. But Chalice is so low. Chalice is going to go down. PSG They've lost three F5 with the TPL, won't make it! The slide of fish, the change, Anna catches out the shaker, can he TP back in time before the curse kills him? Yes, he can! Well, that's exactly what we talked about, the stolen boat. The yep. round buff on Anna just pushed them over the edge for the spike. Roshan and PSG LGD are well aware. Roshan's up. It looks like only OG knows. Oh, right. Nah, mate, Yo, Anna. Anna. He's some illusion, illusion action. Armin's gonna get caught out by the tornado, though. They've opened up onto him, Arme, trying to get on top of Anna. The BKB popped by Chalice, he'll get the ult out. No Tail getting on straight away by F5 with the snowboard. No Tail's dead for 100. They'll get the Chen, Anna, in the midst of it, trying to lock down onto FY. The rest of his team about to come over, they get the Tornado. Out onto X7, looking for the cool control onto Arme. Has he got it? Arme getting stunned up by the cool snap, but he's able to wait for up to the high ground. Thompson blinks in, he gets the Hex up on FY with the snowball save. They get the bash out, Sonus will be able to find the eye. He gets the call of his lifetime as three dead now on LGD. No buyback. Simple. Not until the super, super, super late game dragon. And then even out. then, then you're playing versus super late game with an e with a, when they have an ET who buffs yeah. up everything. He makes everyone do more damage. Solo. Rest in peace. Goodbye. From a distance. Oh, I think. Hey, he dodges it. He dodges it at least. He's not dead yet. But he is dead. Oh. Uh, oh, he styles on him. That's just oh, me. he styles. He waits. That's just me. He, 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 he didn't get needed the maelstrom, but yeah, he, he relied. He didn't get the maelstrom, he would have lived. Essentially being this moving water vision for EG. Giving them the information that they need. Gonna go He's going to go here. Drops the Wukongs into the boundless strike. S4 trying to get himself out of the circle of doom, but there's the horn. Not going to go for that one. Living armor. Ah, there we have it. The steward to cancel the TP. S4 will get taken down. Took a lot of skill. Anna's coming do. in for this. Anna wants to get the kill, and he's going to do it, and he gets back out. Oh, oh so sick. Do you see how he that? He puts a remnant down before he TPs, and then when he gets there, he puts the remnant where the oh, monkey came from. He doesn't even need it. go. <laughs> Gets a kill another little battle. We're going to poop. So it pops a BKB and no tells. I'm poop into his dick. going to as soon as he comes up. I'm sure. And oh, or Ravage. Yeah, that works too. There's a Kronos Spear and also catches in the back line. They're going to go for the rack. Now there's a bite at him, which is happy. And the Moonlight Shadow's activated by Marauder right there. Anna's going in. Hotel is looking for a target. They ping him out. Throws out some nets, but Marana putting the damage in and no time. Poops on it with the others. But Ami jumps back in on Faceless Boy. Not a spear with Gil Scepter. Some of them still alive to come kicking in. But they also go Faceless Boy. Nice job with the Fire Revenant on the first cut out. And uh, no tail, but he actually gets picked off in the back line. And is not going to live as the only core right now for his team. Somnus, Marana will die in the midst of it. Anna staying alive this whole time. Gil Scepter throwing up in the air again. The slide of fist and the A, a goes down as well. And now it's just Levin all of a sudden. The Raid Boss is still alive. And they're going to take him out of Kill Up Spree for Ember Spree. 
Can he find a chance for the RP Chalice on the high ground? They're going to head into the pit, OG. They're confident, knowing Seb can sit there on the high ground, ready with the counterplay, Arme. Getting sprouted, Chalice. Looks to make a play, jumps in. Immediately going for it with the lasso. Has he got the control to get the damage out? He can. That's going to be Arne dead. But Anna buys back straight away. Arme moving in with the BKB. Roche has still alive throughout this all. They've lost Thompson. The slide, the change, the remnant across. They'll get the kill onto Chalice. Bubble. But now Arne's in the middle of it all. Yules it himself with the flame guard. Ticking it for down like the slide of fist. The RP. Seb, he's got the control. They can end it because they of that. Look at Look this. <laughs> Dude, and, and this is backdoor protection, by the way. This, this is backdoor protection. Do, I guarantee they're doing this on purpose. They're like, guys, don't even get the creep wave. Yep. I love Peter. He knows. He's like, wait, this game's probably over, but what can we do? Still backdoor protection. They are just melting it. There will be a stun for it. It is going to be two. Lincolns will proc one. They find the axe this time. He will get put under, though. There's going to be an ulti from 33. Already tanks on him. He gets rooted, so he can't even get on top of anyone. Seb just gets his BKP up. OG's just kiting around everywhere. Ace has to run away. He just dies to the <laughs> <laughs> it's too Radiant. much. It's the Anna IO. They're just going into there. They can't do anything. They're all just spraying. What can you do? Give someone a rampage. I don't think they can. They're going into the fountain. They're waiting for NIP to call GG, but they won't. And look at this. They go in. Anna with the triple kill. Anna with an ultra kill. There's a Sand King. Where is he? They know. The IO doesn't have ulti to come get him, though. It looks like they to catch out the tree. OG's done just such a miraculous job of keeping these tier ones alive. It's pretty crazy. And they're also scared. Like, at, the, at any time, the monkey could be in the trees on bottom lane. They could set up with a Spectre. Oh, there he so. goes. He's thinking about popping the Wukong's commands up, and he will. Looks towards X Nova. X Nova caught in the middle of the ring. And it comes over as well to join in the kill. The three of them find one. TP's are coming in. Chalice. Can he set something up with Arme? This now. Look at the jump here on the control. Jarek straight in on it. Arme and Arme pops the BKB, but it's too late. Somnus finds no tell on the side. The buyback's gonna be there straight away from no tell. Somnus zipping across towards Jarek. The all out from the CM, but the meteor armor from Seb's coming down. They've got the chain stun onto X Nova. And it's still alive for now. They get the double kill. The cold embrace. Keep it at her alive. The Winter's Curse holding by the attacks off the chalice. The charge is low fly. He'll fall. Triple kill for Anna. Can he survive? He gets up to the high ground. He's still alive for now. The armor from Seb. Keeping the spec to save. Thompson will fall though. Dives too deep. Anna wants to find Somnus. The Manta style, they get the kill. Ultra it's an kill. ultra kill for Anna, he's still alive. Chalice, he wants this, but can he actually get it? He's got to back off. Anna will TP out, and the definition there of friendship and team play oh, from get on top of that Zeus right away. Get into that back line. I mean, the Rubik and the Zeus are really starting to be quite an issue for them. Chalice, he's in with the opener, straight in with the lasso, the tower will fall, but they'll drag back the Ember Spirit into the tower cut him down with the Tidebringer. He's dead, boys, but on the side. He's dead for 60. Still alive at the moment. And all the Yules! Oh, gets the dodge! Anna up into the end, dodging the Echo Slab. Somnus, he's trapped here in the Sprout. OG, they'll slowly punch down the Kuka. The Stolen Fish and Jarax sets up onto FY. OG take three and up into the base. 28 minutes the team's still on death. Because if you die in a team fight, it's great. But if you die, you know, when you get picked off or whatever, it's just a lot of extra gold for the enemy team. Aggressive Pops is BKB. Seb is going to be ruptured. Immediately Cold Embrace. Underneath the Zeus, though, Nimbus Clown. It should be able to do some damage, but they don't want to focus on him. It's first is going to be No Tail. No Tail does die. Around their shrine, though, Aaron still trying to finish up. Aaron Sarf does manage to get the time lapse off. Seb is still alive. He's okay, but they already got the Lugona Blade on the Bulba Cup. Bring him down to half health. Zeus gets a little bit more damage, but Seb managed to draw the distance on X. X has an and runs him down with a Phantom Rush. And now Aggressive. I'm not sure if he could take this fight alone next to SRF is still trying to pick up the supports, but Aggress is going to be run down oh, by the Phantom Lancer. So Phantom Lancer actually managed to get Blood Rite silenced, but still they get a stun out from the Dragonite onto Aggressive. Blood Seeker goes down. SRF just can't possibly do the damage. Winter's Curse holds him in place. Bulbacon is that a now? Duo, the buybacks coming in. The Undying's going to try and help him out, but SRF guys. doesn't have the mana. He's already dead. Anna, it's just too big, and he still has full HP as well. Bulbacon is going to die the illusions here. As IG multiple buybacks, OG start retreating a little bit, but Anna thinks 
about it. He knows how strong he is. He can still keep on going. In fact, he's going to try and go and help out Jerry's again aggressive. Good play he's by Jerry's getting onto the high ground. Also, Rampage will focus on Q. Like, mana, he's just going to keep on rampaging through all of these heroes. They don't have BKBs. They don't have the AOA damage to be able to deal with his illusions. He stays like the centaur. The centaur starts with the blood right. He kills the centaur, but he finally oh. dies. What the hell are the neutrals doing? That's it. In 17 minutes. And OG's looking, they're looking to fight here. They feel oh, they, they know that this Echo Slam is still on cool. How long till RP is back up? RP's there, they look for the setup onto Arme. They get the chains onto him, jump forward, Sam! Oh, the RP just on the tip, pulls him in, but it's not enough to buy time to kill him. It's Arme, there with the turnaround, past the Sunder onto Anna, Anna's able to remnant out to the side. Chalice hiding in the trees, Thompson starting to throw out the lightning as Arme, Chalice backing away, skewer forward for Seb as he clears out the trees. Chalice still with a firefly, getting himself away, will jump himself away from the Nimbus, backs himself up. X Nova's got to be careful, he's incredibly low. They're looking to set up with the torrent. Arme, he's been sprouted, the stolen Fisher for Jerex, out onto Arme, but that fights in with the slab. Is it enough? No, it's not. LGD, they've lost two yet again, but they have managed to find two in return. And are still alive, the flame guard keeping it fine again. The slide of fish cuts down a second double kill for Anna. Chalice surrounded by seven Anna here in the trees as OG get the team wipe. Can't take this fight. So far, they're right. They even have the save. EG's going to smoke up, however. Radio what do they do? You want to wrap around the back? Smoke's already breaking on Samael. Sev's the one on the front line. He's got BKB. He knows he can just be that attractor. Who wants to come in from EG? The melee barracks doesn't really stand a chance. Another sleep. This one's over on faces forward. Ogre jumping into the back lines. Anna instantly jumps back out to help his teammates. The BKB Ogre. It was a good distraction, but EG, what can they really get out of it? A call down on top of the ramp. Set moves forward. Here comes Anna going on top of Arteezy. Where's the opening still? Flies going down. He just cannot take this bark or bite. And now the jump in from... with none of them left. Gyrocopter doesn't have enough power. OG will not let up and Thompson's like, okay, inside your base. I remember doing this in game two of my He's got the DDR TD, RTZ does right now. BKB's on cooldown, Anna's gonna walk into him here. The Manta dodge. Buyback's gonna come out for a set. They feel like they can maybe try and take this fight, but Samaeli's in with the combo. The damage is too much, oh Anna just getting God. critted down. They've lost Jerex, Anna trying to run himself away, but the burn's too much. Seb jumps in, the buyback, the hawk from Anna. He's, he comes into play, can he turn this one around? Seb falling low, taken down by the homie whistle. They'll get Arteezy, can they get anything more? They're able to oh, find Tiny, more. they're able to find Flo. The buyback hawk from Anna, absolutely doing it. The buyback's there from OG. Just during that time that he was running around doing so. He now has full vision of OG. Yeah, he sees Anna farming these ancients right oh, now. Oh, Anna. FY just giving so much information for the team. He's got eyes on him. We'll get the punch on the wrong target, but the snowball pass will catch Anna. Anna, he's in trouble. The blood right silence connects. He's got the man to back up in a second, but can he really play his way out of this one? He cannot. Seb jumps in, gets the call onto FY. There's the buyback. The cataclysm isn't enough to do anything. It isn't. PSG LGD still fighting strong. Thompson getting focused by Somnus. Seb taken down by Arme. The triple buyback's now out. Zana in trouble. He's pulled back for this one. The deafening blast onto the three of them. Knocks the back. But Anna gets focused. Seb! He's in with the call. He has the control onto the morphing Somnus. Now being chased by Thompson. Picks in with the call. Seb. The PLR is on top of it. They get Somnus too. Garrick's. Set up for the top lane. And oh. He's going for black hole. He he's, gets it. He's going to commit it for it. The BKB was popped, but obviously the black hole is still going to be able to pull him in. Midnight Pulse doing a serious amount of damage. Brings him down to about a quarter of his life, but he looks to pop onto Jerex here. The ulti comes out from the Wyvern. Can they go for the finish? On the other side, ROTK, though, gets an instant blast takedown, and No Tail instantly out of this fight here, but they did already lose Freeze. Now the Dazzle gonna be going down. Epicenter and a re wow. from Aggressive secures a double kill as they get the takedown onto Jerex here. Ana looking to step back and join the side of Fly, but it's actually OG on the run as Aggressive makes his move in. ROTK will skewer on forward, looking to go for Fly. Self Cold Embrace keeps him alive for a bit. Nice little blink to the low ground to make it away here, but they're still on pursuit. Step back and here comes those chains. You and you 
trying to hold them back, but they will get the fish. Fly's gonna get dropped. Another chains. Locking down on a triple remnant going on in, but a quick jump the back. BKB, though. He pops it out now. He's looking to move in. Can he get the crit necessary to get the finish on for Ana? No, doesn't get it there. Gets the shoved on board. The Midnight Pulse gets the fish onto aggressive, and then they get the cleanup job on the ROTK. R and Jesus not favoring VG on this day. OG run it right back in. They're looking to go for the five-man wipe. Can Ana get it here? He will. Yes, he can.